were participating in the Southern New England Regional Championship for VEX Robotics. And we've been working on this robot for about a month and a half, I think, now. There's a lot of different design steps that we need to build a robot. So we start with computer-assisted design. It's basically use a computer to make like 3D images and like models of whatever you're building. And from there, we build basic parts of the robot, so like the drivetrain, the arm, the claw. And once those major parts are assembled, we put them together, and we have the robot. Obviously, the robot, though, still takes a lot of work after that. There's a lot of programming that needs to be done, as well as wiring, to make sure all the motors and sensors are working correctly. Our old robot kind of picked the, picked the stars up and like put them over like that, dropped them over. It's more of a claw. Yeah, it's right. more of like it's a, a claw. It's a front dumper. Mm -hmm. The new one goes behind its back to dump. Yeah. And it can dump heavier objects with stronger. Right, so um, you start off in uh, a two by two, so you have uh, yourself in an alliance, and on the opposing team you have another alliance, or a team. You start in autonomous mode where you program something that throws stars or cubes onto the opponent's side. Um, and then after that, the drivers take control, and so you have stars and cubes. Uh, the stars count as lesser points, to whereas the cubes count as uh, twice as much. There's also a high hang at the end of the round that you can get extra points for. 